Hey everybody, welcome back. So I was actually not expected to make this video today um, because I didn't think this was actually coming in. And that is indeed the new 4K release of Return of the Living Dead from Scream Factory. Um, this is, my package was like, kind of like what happened before with, um, if some of you remember from my other video for Halloween, Army of Darkness, where it was like, you know, they were like traveling different states. This one did the same thing. It shipped, I think, out of Kentucky and then went to several other states, got into my state, then left the state. I think it went to Pennsylvania or something, which I'm nowhere near Pennsylvania. And so like there was no, like it didn't, wasn't out for delivery or anything when I checked this morning. And then I checked this afternoon to see where it was and all of a sudden it said delivered. So here is the new 4K release of Return of the Living Dead, finally. I was hoping it was gonna be like another week or so, you know, before it showed up. And I did get the bundle. Uh, in fact, this literally still has the cellophane on it. I've not even opened up. Uh, so I have this, I do have the pin set, which again is not opened as well and the poster and obviously the poster is uh the one sheet you know a small version of the one sheet which is cool i'm actually really happy that they're doing this with uh, a lot of their like 4k releases that have uh the original one sheet artwork on them and they're just offering these like small versions which you can see here mm, get in focus um you know an awesome you know smaller version of the one sheet with that fantastic artwork on it so which i absolutely love i do have an original one sheet as some of you know i actually have it autographed um i think by just about everyone i think i just see miguel nunez on it actually i need to get miguel nunez on that and my friday five poster so hopefully i can meet him one day because i i really need him on those two posters anyway very cool that it came with that and now let's dive into the movie Pull this off real quick. And let's see. So here's the slip cover, which again, very simple. Just has the, the original one sheet artwork, which is great. And of course the side with the title and there's the back with all the details. And then I think the inside case is pretty much the same. Again, the one sheet artwork side with the title and of course the back with all the details. All right, let's take a look on the inside. So this thing has three discs as I straighten them out a bit. Actually, is there anything on the reverse? No, no, no reverse on the cover. All right, so here's the 4K disc right here. And then the Blu-ray disc with the uh, with the film and a bunch of the special features. And then uh, an extra Blu-ray with uh, the rest of the special features. And let me just take a quick look at the... Uh, I got some smudges on that. I'm going to have to wipe them off. Not a big deal. I mean, this stuff usually wipes off pretty easily. But still, you know, it's like... it's Although, honestly, it's like... It seems like most of the discs I get these days have some sort of smudge on the back. And so there's that real quick. And now let's get to the pin set. Um, in fact, here, let me just take the cellophane off so you don't get the glare from the light on it. Okay, and here's the outer box. As you can see, just like the other ones, very simple. There's the title, collectible pin set at the top. And then on the back, nice one with the zombie that's on the poster. And I think on the side, it's just title on one side and gutter garbs and screen factory on the other. Because these are gutter garbs uh, pins. And uh, let's see if I can get the cover off. Maybe. Can I? Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. So this one has four pins, which you can see right there. The, you know, basically it's the poster, you know, with the three zombies that are on the main poster. And then obviously they're back from the grave and ready to party pin. I thought this had one more pin. I think I'm thinking of some of the other ones that do actually have five pins. But these are a little bit more involved than some of the other sets too. So very, very cool. I love the pins. I mean, I know they're a little pricey, you know, kind of tax on a bit. Bit of the price, you know, and you can debate whether or not it's worth it or not. I Probably a little bit more than they should be you know but i still really really like them and as far as the disc goes i mean i think the main i think it pretty much is basically the same outside of the new transfer uh for the 4k which is also on the blu-ray and it is a new transfer it's from two that this year 2022 so uh, i obviously i just got this in so i haven't watched it yet um if and i'm gonna do a review so let me know if you have any questions as far as anything you want me to cover um obviously i already know that the one song is not in the film because of a licensing i know it's not there so like i'm already not going to expect it but if there's anything else you want me to look for outside of the obvious ones that i'll do in a review uh, just let me know otherwise keep an eye out for that in the next couple days and I just want to do this real quick i mean it's you know <laughs> i probably not a really very really special video but i'm super excited that this is finally here so again let me know if you have any questions and as always thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one